What is going on everyone? Good morning and welcome to a new week. It is 6.50 in the morning on Monday and I am up and at it because this week I am challenging myself to run and do cardio every single morning this week, shooting to do a 5k Monday through Friday, maybe Monday through Saturday, and then still working out in the evening as well. So trying to do two days and just trying to see what it does for me. Uh, last night I did go to bed really late. I did. I went to bed around 2.30 or 3, so I only have a few hours of sleep. So we'll see uh, how fast I run this very first 5k, but uh, it was kind of, uh, to be honest, it was really hard getting up this morning and deciding to go out and make this happen. Like I almost just stayed in bed because I was so tired, but I'm glad that I decided to push forward <sighs> and let's just get this going so that I can get ready for work here in the next 40 minutes so I better run this 5k pretty fast <laughs> all right here we go oh man I just finished my run this morning and it's crazy how you have such a mental block in your head sometimes like I woke up this morning and I was like you know I only got four hours of sleep probably not gonna be able to run that fast and I surprised myself and ran my fastest time ever it's just like those little things can sometimes just make your day and really show you that you can do a lot more than what your mind thinks and I don't know, it's just, uh, I think this is a good start to the week. I'm kind of excited to see what happens for the next few days. All right, I made it to work, I'm on lunch. Just to show you, I eat this pretty often. Um, I usually just eat a turkey sandwich and I throw spinach, lettuce, onions, a little bit of mustard, because there's no calories in mustard. And then I usually have some fruit and sometimes I'll spoil myself and have a little bit of chips. Now the reason for that is just because it kind of helps me prevent from kind of having those cravings for unhealthy food. So I try to take it moderation, just try to take a serving and that's it for the day. And that way I feel like I can kind of keep myself on track better. So anyway, I'm going to eat this and then I'll hopefully see you guys tonight for uh, this evening's workout and we'll see how it goes. All right. Welcome to my quarantine gym, which is my bedroom. Um, I got home from work about an hour ago, feeling a little tired. So the lack of sleep probably isn't helping. I did have my guru energy drink to kind of help me pick myself up for the last couple hours, but starting to wear off. Um, when I came home though, I remembered that I wanted to start taking a probiotic. I bought it about a week ago and had it in the fridge. So me and my girlfriend are gonna test it out and see if it helps my body in any way uh, when it comes to my immune system and all of my movements and just see um, if I see any difference with the way that it affects my health. So but for right now, I'm gonna jump into my upper body workout today. I already filmed it in last week's video, so if you want to see it, you can go back and check it out. Um, I'll put the link above. And uh, But anyway, I'm going to jump into this, and I'm just going to do something simple for dinner. So I had my turkey sandwich for lunch, and I honestly might just do it again for dinner. I'm just really tired, and I know I'm going to be going to bed super early tonight because I want to have plenty of energy for my run tomorrow, but I also know my body needs the rest. So, okay, I'm going to go wrap up this Monday, and I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Good morning. I got my lovely bed head. I got plenty of sleep last night. I got about eight hours, maybe eight hours and 10 minutes of sleep. It's a lot more than yesterday. Currently doing my warm up walk of about five minutes, and then I'm going to do my day two of running a 5K. So let's see if I can improve and do better than um, my time yesterday. So. All right, I finished my run today, and I ran it even a little bit faster. That's crazy. I'll talk about it more in my uh, Wednesday video that I'm gonna be doing about my running. So um, whenever that comes up, just keep a lookout and uh, go ahead and watch it for me. That'd be great. But um, yeah, I'm pleasantly surprised. I think a lot of this running has to do with my mentality, and that I'm surprised that I'm more physically fit than I thought, so it's kind of a good start to my day again. I think uh, this might become a new habit for me. We'll see. Good morning, guys. It is Wednesday, and I didn't film any more yesterday because my dog got sick. Uh, so after work, I went straight to the vet with my girlfriend and had to deal with her for a little while. Um, and I totally forgot that uh, yesterday was also my rest day slash cheat day. So I had some dinner and uh, I didn't do an evening workout. I just did my run in the morning. Um, but now I'm out. It's around almost 
seven, so I really need to hit this workout hard because I need to start getting ready for work. So let's see if I can uh, do better with my time today or at least do the same. I could tell yesterday I was very uh, fatigued towards the end. So I tried to make sure I had a lot of water this morning um, and let that settle for a little bit before coming out to run. So uh, time to uh, head out there and do my best. All right, workout is done. Did a kettlebell workout. I'm out here doing my weekly routine on grilling some chicken and uh, have a different seasoning this time, so hopefully it turns out okay. I'm gonna have it with uh, rice and broccoli. And um, I actually sent a challenge upon myself to do my 5Ks right. So tomorrow I'm gonna run my 5K, but I'm just gonna run it all in one direction. Typically what I do is I run 1.55 miles in one direction and then I turn around and then come back and I'm basically already at my apartment complex at that point. Uh, but tomorrow, since it's my day off and I have extra time, I'm going to run the full 5K, the 3.1 miles in one direction, and then I'll turn around and start walking back, and then I'll get my extra steps in for the day. Uh, my girlfriend's gonna come along with me, so I'll have some company. But yeah, that's kind of my idea for tomorrow. Good morning guys it is thursday and i'm currently out for my run 7 30. um yeah today's my day off so i'm gonna go quickly do this run maybe walk a little bit longer just because i have the time and then i will um i don't know what i'm gonna do today i think i'm gonna try to run around and do some other stuff so all right i just finished my run I'll tell you guys more about it in um another video that i'm doing but i finished it feeling good i'm gonna go finish the rest of my day All right, so uh, I went home after my run and I passed out basically. I just drank some water and I just went to sleep and didn't really do much else today. So it wasn't very a productive day, um, but that's all right. I have some things I'm trying to accomplish the rest of this week. I do have Saturday off. So after I get off work tomorrow, I'm actually gonna try to see if I can get a haircut uh, since everything's opening up, but I'm gonna be wearing my mask, of course. I've done work at two days two days this week two two or three dude no i only did it monday and wednesday and i was supposed to do it tonight but i slept through i might still do it later maybe i won't not putting too much pressure on it because i'm still going to be doing it um tomorrow and the next day and i'm still going to try to hit at least four or five days of doing both running and doing work it so oh, good morning it is friday i'm not too tired i did take a nap yesterday so I think I'm feeling okay. I finally came out to do my run at a decent time, so it's 6.30 right now. This is the last day of the week of the challenge when it comes to running a 5K. I actually realized that I started running a 5K last Friday, um, and I did it Friday, Saturday, I took Sunday off, and I started the challenge on Monday. So technically, if after I run today, I've ran six days in the last week, which I think is pretty cool. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna go finish my run and then quickly get ready for work because I have an early meeting today. And then hopefully, crossing fingers, I can get my hair cut done um, in the afternoon after I get off work. So I finished my work shift, I got my hair cut, I got a few groceries at Costco, and now I am back at the house. I just gotta get everything inside and then I need to work out tonight because I didn't work out last night, I just did my run in the morning. So I need to get back on my weight training, which is just me doing some body weight exercises and twerk it. So I am going to go put that all in the house. And then tonight I'm having the bands of pasta for dinner. Um, 
with some marinara sauce. I'm sure we'll throw some spinach in there. All right, it's Saturday and I totally did not work out last night. Um, end up having to do some things at the house. I was feeling pretty tired, so sadly this week I think I've done more running than actual weight training, but that's okay. I will do some workouts today this afternoon and then I'll probably still work out on Sunday. I don't know, I'm feeling good, but I need to better manage my my meal times because I feel like I'm starting to get more hungry or tired by the time I come home to work out in the evening. So I really need to plan my meals a little bit better. Maybe have something that's a little more satiating um, an hour or so before I come home. So anyway, today I'm going to work out and it's actually gonna be a fun workout today because it's a workout that I created. Um, Swerk it reached out to me a little while ago and asked me if I would be willing to create my own workout that they could put into their monthly workout plan. So I'm pretty excited um, that I actually have something with my face on it. Again, I'm not paid by them or anything. It's just an app that I like to use and they just wanted to feature me. So I think that was pretty neat. So that's what we're going to do this afternoon uh, just to kind of just to honor my workout. And it's also going to be my birthday in the next two weeks. So it's kind of a cool little early Christmas present. So. All right, so this week's weigh-in, I was a little bit heavier, so I was at 217.7. Doesn't bother me that much. I know our weights fluctuate a little bit here and there. I've still been on a consistent decline when it comes to my weight, so it doesn't bother me that much. I am just really happy that I was able to accomplish my goal this week, which was running a 5K every single day, Monday through Friday, and I was able to do that. I even ran a 5K a couple days from the previous week too, so I would say running almost seven or eight 5Ks in the last week and a half is really cool. It's still kind of crazy to say that out loud, but I'm feeling happy and accomplished. Um, I know you guys just saw my Swerk It workout, and I think that's something that's really amazing as well, that I'm being featured in an app that I like to use. I'm not paid by them or anything, and just seeing my name in there and that I was able to create my own custom workout was actually pretty neat. So this week was pretty successful. I'm ready to kind of keep pushing on, pushing forward, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this week's video, and I will see you guys all next week.